Hi, I'm Alex. And I'm Maya. Welcome to Art with Alex and Maya. And today, you're going to be painting along with me. So, let's get ready to paint. Are you ready? Yeah. All right, let's go. This is the list of materials that you're going to need. A large paper or canvas, at least 22 by 30. A pencil. Paint brushes. Acrylic paint and a paint pen or an oil stick or a sharpie. Step one, sketch. A sketch is a quick rendering you draw prior to painting in order to get an idea of what you want to create and make the process quicker and smoother. Sketches are usually drawn at a smaller scale with a pencil and paper or on a digital pad. The first thing we're going to draw is the silhouette of a body. The shape of the body is not important. What matters is that it symbolizes you. For example, I am drawing it in my style, which is cartoonish. What we're looking for here is to reflect your own individual style. It can be as detailed or as simple as you want. One of the biggest and most important goals of an artist is to develop their own particular art style. I have a whole video explaining this and you can watch it later by following the link above. In the middle, you're going to draw a heart. It will symbolize your center, the source of all your emotions that in turn will be the source for your inspiration, hence the starting point of our exercise. Utilizing the sketch as a guide, you will now draw your image on the larger format. Then, prepare your colors, grab your paintbrush, and let's start. Colors have meanings, so I'm providing you with this list, which should serve you as a guide to reflect how colors shape your life. Colors play an exceptionally prominent role in our daily lives. They influence our thinking, inspire our decision-making, and even impact our mood. From causing changes to changing reactions, colors are more powerful than we think, as much of human behavior is dictated by color. Make this exercise your personal interpretation of how the different colors influence and relate to you. For example, Red means love, passion, and energy. So that's the color of my heart. I'm starting with yellow for positivity and clarity, followed by romance with pink. A bit of green on the tummy for health. I then surround my right hand with blue for success and confidence. Purple crown for art and imagination. Then a little happiness with orange and finish up with a light purple for spirituality. The idea of this exercise is not to copy what I do, but to introspect and mold the colors following your emotions and so reflecting your personality. Feel free to add more colors. There are no rules. If you have questions about color combinations, the video linked above may answer some. Now let's wait for the paint to dry. Using whichever tool you prefer, paint pen, oil stick, or the Sharpie, you're going to start detailing the shapes. I will use all three for you to see. Face, arms, hands will start taking shape. Then you can start adding words and phrases to strengthen your message. Dig down into yourself to convey your deepest feelings. Finish by adding more details for contrast. Sign the painting. Then step back. Take a final look at your work and you're done. 
We hope you enjoy painting with us. And your hands should be as dirty as ours, because the dirtier, the better. And also, please punch that subscribe button and all that to get notifications when the next video is about to come out. See you later. Bye.